first you will start off by logging into your my.uic.edu portal. And then in the center of the page, you should have this XE registration widget. You will click there. Now you've got many options here. We highly recommend using the class scheduler because that will actually create schedules for you. You just enter the classes that you need and the system will generate a schedule for you and you pick the schedule that you like the best. But if you just need to register for a single class or you know which class you want to register for, you can just go directly to register for classes. You'll select the term open for registration and click continue. From here, you've got several options, find classes, enter CRNs, plans, and schedule and options. We're going to remain on the find classes tab. And we're gonna begin with our subject. We're gonna be registering for kinesiology 245 today. So we'll enter subject kinesiology. We'll leave the class title blank, and then you'll just enter the course number 245. We recommend checking the open sections only box. You will then click search and it will bring up all sections that are still open. Now you'll notice for a class like KN245, it has both a lecture and a lab component. This means you'll need to register for two components of the class. You'll need to register for the lecture and then you'll need to register for a lab. So to do that, you'll select the lecture that you want. In this case, there's only one option. You'll click add and then you'll select the lab time you want. So then you'll come up here and you'll click add as well. Once you've added both components to your summary, you'll come down here. You'll notice in the left hand, lower left hand window, a preview of your course schedule will appear. Note that it still says pending. This means you are not actually registered for the course if it's in gray and it says pending. To complete your registration for the course, you will click Submit. When the course turns a color and it, the status says registered, that means you are registered for the course. You can confirm the number of credit hours that you're registered for here at the bottom of this window. So I'm currently registered for a total of three hours. Keep in mind that you must be registered for a minimum of 12 hours to be considered a full-time student at UIC although it's good to average 15 hours every semester to graduate within four years. Some scholarships and grants, such as the MAP grant, do require you to be registered for at least 15 credit hours to receive the full award amount. So consult with your academic advisor if you're not registered for 15 hours.